let's see what is what are the options are available there as you can see here this is the uh, filmora interface if you can see here uh, if you go to file menu and uh, under record media uh, you see three options are there uh, record from webcam that is the option is available if you have the camera connected to your PC uh, that uh, you can use it uh, if we click on that uh, you will see another uh, dialog box will open uh, where you have the camera list here because you know I uh, I don't have the camera attached to my PC so no camera is available here uh, there is no list for that but if you have the camera attached to your PC you will see your camera listing here so this is uh, that how you can use your webcam so then there is another option that is voiceover this is just like your uh, normal PC audio recorder just like any sound recorder maybe you have on your mobile on your computer on your laptop uh, this is the same function available here as well but there is a one checkbox here that is mute uh, mute if you uncheck that one anything that is uh, played in the background on your computer that will not be uh, recorded uh, the third option that is today I am focusing and I am going to tell you that is how you can record your screen for your tutorial and sometimes uh, during your lecture or something you are going to explain you need to record screen so this is the main uh, dialogue for uh, recording the screen appear here and you can see here this is uh, the option for the output audio that is you can see here uh, uh, on the left side where is the speaker icon uh, this is is where if you have multiple output uh, devices for example sometimes you have your uh, mobile and in my example I have my Samsung TV connected to my PC so that's why you can see here Samsung uh, TV is appearing here in the device list but if you have your built-in uh, built-in speakers uh, just like your uh, laptop uh, uh, that is also uh, will be displayed here that but that is depends on you that how you want to use your uh, output for the speakers there is on the right side you can see here the if you have uh, mic and what are the options available here also you can have a mic if you have connected external mic you can uh, you connect it with your PC uh, or you have built-in mic uh, with your laptop uh, that you can select from here on the left side very left you can see here uh, for record mode uh, there are th three options are there uh, full screen that means whatever uh, the screen is displayed on your desktop on your laptop that will be captured uh, including your status bar including your top bar left whatever the uh, is appearing and shown on the screen that will be uh, recorded custom is uh, what is that uh, you click on here you see here uh, uh, rectangle uh, this is uh, uh, is uh, selection is appearing you can wide it you can uh, narrow it uh, you can expand it according to your need and there is third option is target windows target windows mean if you have a specific window you have many windows and if you want to just target and record specific windows that is only will be recorded in screen so these are the options uh, mode for recording on the very right you can see the wheel button here uh, if you expand it you will see number of uh, options are there uh, the one was that how you can save 
your file what is the path uh, of your uh, recording normally uh, this is the default path uh, for recording your screen uh, in your uh, documents in user profile but you can choose according to your convenience uh, where you can uh, uh, um, where you can have access to your files and where you can memorize and you can understand where your files are being saved uh, there is another option second option frame rate that is uh, that defines your uh, frame per second uh, the more uh, bigger size that will be the better for example 60 uh, frame per second you I choose it and that is the better quality you see here the quality in the drop down battery is automatically uh, selected because I chose 60 uh, frame per second there are three options are available here good better and best and uh, you s if uh, you have good if you select good the file size uh, of recording will be small and it will not have big size it will not occupy a space from your uh, computer and hard disk uh, so I chose better that is a medium one so you can but choose best uh, uh, according to your need so I chose the better one now there is another option record timer uh, you see here there is a checkbox this is unchecked by default uh, but you can uh, select it you can tick it according to your uh, need uh, you know sometimes uh, you want to record something uh, from your laptop from PC but you don't want to be uh, on on screen and you want to go somewhere and maybe it, it might be for one hour two hours and you don't want to be attendant you want to go outside so you can just uh, put your s screen recorder on and you can specify the time here hours minutes and seconds you can see here by default it is unchecked and you see the numbers uh, are disabled uh, uh, you cannot edit it but if you check it it will becomes editable the other option is uh, mouse pointer uh, sometimes uh, you need to click somewhere you need to choose uh, something during your screen record so this is these are the uh, mouse pointers are here and what are the colors you want to choose it is a green blue uh, according to your uh, choice the other option is there here uh, play uh, mouse click sound uh, it depends on you that you want to because there is a one sound when you click any mouse uh, the sounds come it beeps uh, so it depends on you that you want to record that sound as well or not so accordingly you can make uh, checkbox if you want to record uh, the sound as well you make it checked and if you don't want you can un uh, check this uh, check uh, box this option and then if you see here uh, there is a pause resume hotkey you can you see sometimes if you are attendant and uh, the screen recorder is very sensitive and uh, many times you have to pause many times you have to stop somewhere and then restart so there is a F10 button you can use it for pause uh, if um, if you have some urgent work somewhere to go or you you want to switch to some other work you can make your screen recording as pause uh, for temporarily and then if you once if it is recording is on so if you press f10 it will pause but if it is already paused if you just press f10 again it will resume it will restart your screen recording and f9 the same way same behavior but only it is for stop and for start so these are the hot keys and uh, you can specify your own uh, hot keys as well according to your convenience but by default these keys uh, comes you know there is another uh, the last but the bottom one if you see here camera uh, 
and sometimes you want to record your live uh, video or your your live uh, recording so uh, here is a camera you can use uh, your attached camera with your PC